Devil Dragon, your boy, hey man, Sliking. back with some new heat for y'all today. You heard what she said. Let's get it, man. How y'all doing today? Oh shit. Back with some more One Piece. You now I'm saying, crazy story. Yes, sir. Kozuki Clan got some explaining to do. We need to put them on trial. Facts, bro. How do you know go do Roger? Why do you have a tombstone? What's up with these graves, motherfuckers? Why are your hair cut like that? <laughs> Where's Odin? We gonna find out, man. When we gonna find out? I feel like. They brought this up with the grave stuff, and we ain't gonna find out for like a few, quite a few episodes. The actual story is. I'm gonna hope that it's not like that. We need something. Give me something. Damn, I need something, bro. Yeah. Facts. I feel like we just. I just need more. I need more lore. I'm starting. Yeah. I'm starting to feel like like the lore has been lowering, and lowering, and lowering. I need. I need that to be picked back up. I need that mystery. I need stuff to connect. I need to progress the overall story of one piece we need to progress facts they're putting that mug on the pacing hole like uh, yeah I mean, we get a little bit of something but it ain't it ain't been given all right give it to mm -hmm. us man so hopefully hope we figure it out then we get to the olden castle figure out more about this this sleeper cell of a woman i don't know who she is you know what i'm saying okiku yeah, yeah but tall as hell. Better. So I don't know where she came from. I guess she just—I I guess she could just be tall. It's tall women in the world, so she could just be tall and just still be from Wano. You never know. Yeah. Yeah. I'm ready to get to it, man. See what else gonna happen. See what else we learn, man. Same here. Let's run it up. Let's get it. He said, "Ghost." He said, "Don't leave me hanging." I can't fill him in now a little bit. She ain't, she don't see not phased about none of that. She probably a ghost too. Hey, it's like that, Zoro. White tiger. They that was my first favorite animal, a white tiger. For real? Yep. Then it moved to a wolf. It's a wolf now. Today you're learning history. Is that the dude from Spy Family? <laughs> he looked exactly he so like, like a dog. Who was that? Who lower these haircuts in Wano Boy? Orochi. Who did Sushi say? That's a Evil child? Evil people pass. It's a... Kazaya 9. She can give you some neck from him. From she be in the bedroom. We'd be in the kitchen. <laughs> For real. Kaido. Are they family? This old man know it's some cap. Orochi Kazuki. This will be going on in our schools now, man. Poisoning these kids' minds. That guy, that must be him. Fake Frankie? Kozuki Clan's money changer. Napping Kyoshiro. Is that Robin in the back? Oh, yeah. 
On the line rolling of 20 years. How is he still roaming about if he was with the if he if he's with the Kozuki clan? That's why you don't drink, people. He said, how did he interpret it? Again. Open up the land of one of I mean, they here? Yeah. If they died in Wano, why not show up in Wano automatically? Why have to travel back to Wano? We cornered them in the castle. Oh, never mind. Them all alive. I thought he was on their team. All right. So I didn't know what the hell, like. Why she crying? She must have been Family. here. Yeah, she uh, she knows. Mom, dad, granddad, son. It's a lot of animals running around with swords, bro. Yeah. Everybody got a sword in one of Forget Luffy. Maybe this and the baboon came from the same uh, leader. I wonder what he gonna say when he see him. They can't be ghosts because you physically touching them. Right, like they interacting and attacking. I don't know. It can't be ghosts. So quality version of ghosts. Thumbs up. It's reanimated type stuff. That's a rise. Oh, the best picture of Conjure I've ever seen. Why you gotta stand in there like so? Right, you trying to be all melancholy? Yeah. <laughs> I'm thinking they passed just recently, but no. I hope you don't think they just died. That'd be funny. That's what, that's, yeah, that's what I'm thinking. My like, daddy just died today. <laughs> I don't think they ghost because he's able to touch him. It's just weird. Then he's talking to Zanisha, like, come on now. It's like, you know how Naruto had, like, the reanimated jutsu? I could see that. Yeah. yeah. If they do that, then that, that makes sense. You said you're going to tell him what's the guy here. Uh, is they about to come out? Probably just waking up. <laughs> Uh, didn't we see them eat food at a banquet too? We saw them eating food on the boat. Yeah, the ghost part is kind of crazy. You wake up like you wake up yawning and shit. Stuff. Stretch. I'm mostly stretch. That's Kenna, man. What the freak? Why they keep showing them in different like shades and stuff? The runs. So you misguided me. Sama. They both the same. They both got the hype. And she on top. Yeah, she know everything. Yeah. Lord, don't know. Hey, Bobo no say. Okay. Man, what's the deal with this ghost shit, man? I'm still trying to figure this out. He clearly not ghosts. Crazy. Right. Yeah, where they at? 
Shut your ass up. She don't know that they cool, man. Yeah, calm down. Okiku. Chilling. I want to see them. I, I want to see them go into that uh that that form. I forgot what it was. I forgot what it was called. Yeah, the uh, the night form. The yeah, moment, it's something weird. Too long. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Please, please give us a good outfit. Please. Yeah, Sanji. Let's go. <laughs> Got carrot. Mommy, find your beaver card. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> that boy said, "Oh, Nani." <laughs> he said, "Get off of me." And we here. You still missing Frankie, Usopp, Robin. Yep. Hey, boy, he done get a lot of milk, boy. I'll be lighting it up too. You say like titties did it. Man, what y'all eat? Everybody got the runs, bro. Hey, going crazy. <laughs> Kenneman, you got some explaining to do. How long are you going to keep doing this? Not telling us everything. Thank you. Hey. <laughs> Just tell us everything. He's still going to have stuff. Right. Five of us all together. It came from the past. They pulled the trunks? They traveled? Is it like something Odin did or something? So those are fake? I didn't think that like that can happen in like One Piece. Yeah, like... It's, it's, so... I want to see how they did this. Yeah. <laughs> right. right, Luffy. That's what I'm saying. And that's how he 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 knew Goldie Roger. They time travel. Yeah, this thing is very uncharacteristic of like One Piece. Time traveler. Like lead that to Attack on Titan. You know, that's a serious thing, even though that's kind of like that. But yeah, man, that's okay. I can understand being frozen and then released for 20, 20 years after 20 years. Well, you adding time travel? So now somebody got like a time travel fruit or something or a device or Dr. Um, what's his name? Yeah, man. Uh, Vegapunk. Vegapunk. Yeah. You got a time travel device or somebody got a time travel devil fruit or Odin did something and brought him back and time travel for him. This stuff got to be super sacred. Got to be secluded to the Kozuki. Gotta be something that's not, like, you know, not easily accessible. Yeah. I like, I respect Oda. It's his story. You know what I'm saying? I ain't saying it'd be different. I'm just reacting to it as a as a fan of the series. That's I crazy. think that's a that's a we like to me. That's kind of like the Tamate box, like blowing up. Eh, yeah, eh, to me it. It feels super weird for One Piece to incorporate time travel. Yeah, unless we jump into the gun and it's something crazy. What you mean? Like, maybe they was frozen. Maybe they was like... You just said it came from the past. No, I'm saying, like, they could come from the past if you frozen for, like, 20 years. Then then, then you oh, get you unmelted. Said. You see what oh. I'm saying? But if it's just, like, so, come to this portal, like Doctor Strange, and yeah. you walk through, boom. Yo, cool. that's crazy, bro. How did y'all feel about learning yeah, about Yeah, I want to know. And I knew they were no goddamn ghosts, because, one, y'all ate with us. We physically touched y'all. Y'all was sleeping. Like he he touching boobs all the time. 
Y'all doing normal human characteristics that ghosts don't do. That's what they had. They had ghosts in quotation marks too. So I wonder like, did they cut the chapter at the that they ghosts? And I wonder if everybody's like, they're ghosts, oh my God. And didn't think about all the stuff that they did in the past during Dress Rosa and Punk Hazard and stuff like yeah, that. Yeah. Like we Luffy done rolled Momonosuke all the way up from the little trash shoot. Like, come on, yeah, you don't yeah. do that with ghosts, bro. Unless it's yeah. just a one piece ghost, but now that that's debunked, they time traveled. I think that's that's just stupid. It just seems weird, though. It just seems weird. Like, I really want to know how people thought, what y'all thought about like this during this time. It just seems weird. Like it don't fit. Time it's like travel we, yeah, and we, one piece don't like fit. It's like we doing time travel. Like it, it kind of reminds me of um of uh, Dress Rosa, the princess that can heal everybody, that can heal anything. I didn't like her either. It's like something that we can use to just fix everything or. Skip towards us finding One Piece. We could just use that for anything. You see what I'm saying? Like, you oh, just like a Tantata girl. Yeah, like oh. I feel like she was just super, super OP. Like, man, she could have been there for eight. She could have been there for white bitch. You know what I'm saying? Not saying she was going to be. I'm just saying we have that power in the world. It's just yeah. crazy. Yeah. Now we have time travel in One Piece. The time traveling is kind of weird. But... This is kind of close to like Naruto having their aliens. This is close. It's not the same, but I'm saying it's close. This is this is One Piece's version of it. Now we got time well, travel. I really want to know what people were thinking about during this time. If this was y'all was just mind blown, like wow, Oda, or y'all was like kind of confused too, like you know what I'm saying? I just want to know. This just further proves my point of fate. There are things puppeteering. There's a puppeteering thing that's leading Luffy in the D's to either find the One Piece or bring peace to the world. Everything is playing to their hand. They know everything. How do you know in 20 years, Luffy and a group gonna come? If, 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 if everything is not going on fate, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Prophecy of fate, same thing to me. Prophecy yeah. is the same thing as fate. You see what I'm saying? Like this, this is what I be talking about. The fact Luffy getting saved by dragon just randomly like that. You see what I'm saying? It's just like, and come he on. Basically, he, basically you saying it's more than in plot armor and MC type stuff. It's yeah, it's like, it's like, it's like, you, what you're saying with it. They know for a fact that this person, this group is going to, you know what I'm saying? Help Wano, help, help the Koz Koziki clan, uh, Koziki, Koziki clan, find a One Piece, you know what I'm saying? It's like yeah. all these stuff is working in favor for them. Every time it's something near death or something very close, something comes out of nowhere and saves them. Some type of, some type of special weapon, Poseidon, some type of special animal or, Situation. Oh, we got we got to make sure the straw hats keep pushing forward. Yeah. I wonder why. Because there's people. Come on, man. I wonder how many people know about this time travel. It's not just random. It's not just random. I don't know. Like to me, if it was a lot of people that knew about it, it would have probably got snatched by now. You know what I'm saying? Like kill the person and then go find it, or Doctor Vega Punt. That's the only person I know how to do it. That's my only two things. I'm thinking this. Anytime I think about something that's crazy. I think Vega Punk made it, or it's a devil fruit. I don't think, yeah, that's facts. There's nothing really else in One Piece that you can kind of say what happened, unless it's some magical crap. You know this, what I mean? this gotta be, this, I hope this is something other than a devil fruit than, and then Vega Punk. If he had a time travel devil fruit, that's this thing's crazy. way higher than devil fruit. Vega Punk. Um, I wanna see Vega Punk so bad, bro. But ain't nobody worried about this, because everybody wants the pony glyphs, everybody trying to find One Piece, nobody's talking about. <laughs> The time travel and, and stuff like that's what it just seemed like it just came out of like nothing. That was a the reach. time traveling like aspect. I, I know y'all be like older, go, older, older mix it in. Well, you'll see, you'll see. I know, I know. But this is what we're reacting to right now. Yeah. And I'm not a huge fan of time travel, especially in a world like this. Yeah, it's it's kind of weird to me. That's all I'm saying. Yeah. So they came back in time. Other years. shows like Tokyo Revengers. You that know, make, that's, 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 that's that what it's based sense. off of, yeah. You know what I'm saying? But it's, just, it's kind of weird. And this just further proves, this further proves the point on fate, on, on this, whole, this whole thing being on fate, whether this was just Luffy in itself or the Ds. I think those is like, the, like fate is driving them. You know what I'm saying? No, like even, even like I think, um, who was, who, who was talking to him? I can't remember. Who was like talking to him? Damn, I can't remember. I'm trying to think, it was like White Beard was talking to somebody. I can't remember right now. Crazy. Interesting. I'm, I'm, I'm glad they told us now. I see a point with it being like uh, something other than plot armor. Yeah, it's like it's just hard yeah. to like 
since we don't know, it's hard to like try to like make sense of it being something like that. I think it gets more clear, but they keep giving evidence to it. They keep giving us evidence to it. And it's like, it's, it's, it's like to me, it's like common sense. It's like, you should see, it's like every time Luffy is at the, the, the final break or something, we about to die, something magically just either gets see, help that's or the goes point. away or That's something. the point that it, it needs to like different because that could be classified as plot armor. I think, I think it's I the think, same. I think it's the same. It's the same, but it could be more, it's commonly called like just plot armor. But I think the other points that you mentioned is more close to taking it away from plot armor and putting it more in bait. It's the same to me because it's connected with with what's going on. Like say for instance, you got a normal anime character and they on a, you know what I'm saying, the brink of death and then they, opt, they automatically go Super Saiyan. Or you know what I'm saying, like some, some power just activates yeah. them. Then they beat the villain, you know what I'm saying? Plot armor. But this one is it's plot armor, but it's connected because it's in a sense where it's like it's like it's happening over and over and over. And those events are connected to the main overall premise of the story. You know what I'm think, saying? Like I, the fact you're going back 20, you come back 20 years. This that's the point. You know what I'm saying? The, the whole time travel thing, I think, is what made it like the difference. Yeah. Because they are connected, but it's like, this is what makes it, separates it to be able to kind of further like push it more toward like a fake Yeah, thing. Like, I, 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 like I definitely understand that. It's like, I started noticing it when you get all these people saying, Star has need to push forward. They got to do this. They're the ones that's, that's going to save Fishman Island. Uh, somebody's going to do this. It's the fact when you keep seeing that, like, like they're the chosen ones to do all of this stuff. It's like, okay, obviously. So you're saying the there's a God in One Piece. I don't know what the entity is or the group, but a it's, power. Uh, it's 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 like it's like a it's like whatever that D it could be the D it could be Luffy, they're stringing along him through this process in order to achieve this greater goal, whether it be saving the world or finding a One Piece or or because he's liberating all of these countries yeah. anytime he goes there. Yeah, you see what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, definitely. Uh... This is what I like about One Piece. This is what One Piece does that's so different from other animes. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Just in that broad scope of thinking and all of that type of stuff. So I enjoy it. I enjoy when it happens. You know yeah. what I'm saying? It's uh, pretty like, dope. It's, like, it's still dope. I just didn't yeah. like the time travel. Yeah, the time, it just came out of left field. I just feel like, dang, man. Yeah. And they're not wrong with it. It's just, it's yeah. just weird. It's just weird. It doesn't, yeah. it doesn't fit the One Piece world. But then again, what does? Right. Know, it's like, we, it's probably some... How much stuff we about to find out in one over? This for the blow our minds. Yeah, I'm gonna be surprised like, if if if, if, if the sun got that. a devil fruit. Who? The sun, the actual sun itself, the moon. Oh, where, where, <laughs> well, like you kneel is that? You see what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, oh, this a devil fruit. Yeah. Oh, yeah. the water's a devil fruit. It's crazy. It's wild. It's like. At least we was like, you know how like One Piece have the animals where it's like yeah. the cow mixed with the dog. We, that's we when we first seen it, it was like, Bruh, what is this? But then we start to realize this is a part of like the One Piece thing. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like this, we had nothing to really like go off of. Time, time, time it's traveling. A reach. It, it's, it's a reach. It's, it's like a reach. And it's just like, boom, 900 episodes later, time traveling. It's like, what? And that's, and then, and, and that's how he was able to talk to Goldie Roger or to, to, to know about Goldie Roger. Yeah. And that's how they, well, I feel like, I feel like they could have known uh, Dog Storm and other one. Yeah. Uh, Cat, Cat Viper. I feel like they could have known them. But they, they probably know so much stuff, bro. Yeah. Did they sell with them or they just do it? This is way bigger than, they, bro, we got the Revolutionary Army attacking the Celestial Dragons. We got the Pony Glyphs. We got those unknown weapons, those Still weapons. South, South we got Florida. the navy and the the giant hat. We got freaking. What you say about Saw? I said we still don't, we still ain't seen no, no more about Sabo. Oh Sabo. He just he just went away. Sabo. No conclusion. Oh yeah, because they was. Yeah. We got Shank stuff, bro. It's just like it's so many things, bro. That's what I love about One Piece. And um, but this time traveling bro that kind of took me for a loop bro i yeah. ain't gonna cap i ain't gonna it's just it's just weird it's just kind of weird yeah. that, that's that, that's all it is it, it doesn't yeah. take away from the story it's just weird yeah let me and know what y'all think about that stuff man and uh just think about when y'all first saw yeah, this first saw not what y'all do now what y'all when y'all first saw it you gotta explain how that. did you feel about it how did you feel about that yeah 
But yeah, man. Dope. Oh, shoot. Let's go to the next episode. Next episode, y'all. Yeah, let's get it. That's a castle? Blue Line is a castle. Cardboard box. <laughs> Sound like Ace. Oh no, I don't sound like them. Somebody mocked them? Are we getting backstory on Odin? They had a lawless area. Like, um, Sapo and them. Yeah. Hey. I thought you about to hit her next. <laughs> I was like, damn. Hey, you fast. So, yeah, mama, mama? Right. Mopped her. This reminds me of like, um, Nolan and the uh, other dude. Oh, Nolan. Kind of yeah. rivalry. I forgot what his name was. Yeah. Dang, it wasn't this one sided. That's how being a wild, man. Take down the leader. I ain't know how to work. We got a diaper on. <laughs> he went in and made some change. I like that. Diamond. He was 20. Damn. I need to reevaluate. Damn, man. He's still a kid. How do you make a river? <laughs> he bored. He, he need more. He said like he bored. Right. Yep. It's like once he's done with something, it's like, all right, what's next? What's up, Duke? They about to show us Duke in Baby Duke. That's crazy. They like, oh, we got a friend. This brother like really in my life. Like. So that I mean he was cool with Whitebeard and uh Goldie Roger. I you cool with both of them. I ain't saying it's not possible, but Well, Maluska, are you sure that's so that? They seem a lot different. <laughs> he got off the damn thing just for that. <laughs> it got to be something else, man. Horrific death. He was like, they go, D. Roger, bro. Oh, did summer. <laughs> no, you get done in by no little minion. So he got executed? Damn, they was there too. Was their heads first. Mm. I ain't Dang. just gonna be with him. 
During that time. Right. Man, they have to get back. What the heck is that? Probably the beginning of the uh, smile fruit stuff. They look like beastly. Mm. Damn, they mocking them. Like a sister. He had a sister. Left behind in the castle. His mother or sister probably had the time fruit then, or like the time power, because they not with him. Yeah. Mm, I can see the sign. Dang. And they had to go, I, I guess they had to go back to the castle for him. That was the reason. How did they fend off those people? Why they looking so... Uh, place is burning. Dang, his mama, future traveler. She had time, 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 fruit. time fruit. So where the hell she come from? Toki. Maybe she came from the void. Way back in the past. Well, yo, where'd she come from? So she can only go forward. This is like some Attack on Titan type stuff. With Aaron and his dad. How many people can she send to the future? I guess she... <laughs> Look at that. Strange, Dr. Strange. Mrs. Strange looking at she about to coma them, bro. Instead of another location, <laughs> send them 10 years later, 20 years. She seemed creepy. Dang, that's how it happened? Damn, she couldn't land them in a better spot? She just hope I land in a tree or something. Yeah, where's your sister at? Dang, so they came back in Wano. To see that, I know they'd be like, what the hell? Dang! That made me some Pepto Bismol, Beppo. <laughs> I would not want the time time fruit. Yeah, they've been waiting. Yep, generations, but Dope. that man's a legend. Hey. Damn, it was a weird way to close it, close it out. Man, Odin's a W, man. Yeah, Odin. Building up one of them. <sighs> man. Well, that little... What's the place called? Kiri? Mm-hmm. Wallace area. He, like, just became a just... Bro, like I was saying, they, they own version of, like, Goldie Roger, bro. Like, he was just, like, that dude. This monolith, man. Got snaked. I am i don't know really enough. I'm more interested in, in, uh, in Toki. That's not really, like... She said she kept going further and further into the future. So where the hell you come from? Yeah, that girl. Where did you come from? I'm, I'm, I don't know why. I'm just really interested in, in like where the hell she came from. They said she had to have been going in a past past. Like, because they said you only go forward. Yeah, and like she didn't want to go. So it must mean she kind of knew that this this is what she was supposed to do. Yeah. And she probably, probably had an inkling of like what was probably going to happen too. To Odin? Pretty much. Do you think... Dang. And this is why I say fate. A lot of people, I've been seeing a lot of comments, they talking about some, it's, it's like people saying fate. 
but no, I'm talking about fate, meaning like it's it's a prophecy. It's already predetermined on what's supposed to happen or how you're supposed to move in order to save the world. I think uh, when people say faith, it's kind of the same. If you have like faith in something, it's more so like religions and stuff. Like if you read certain books, you know how certain books say certain things are gonna happen and faith means you kind of believe in it. You think it's the same? See, I can understand why people can say faith too, because it's kind of like you believe in, in something that's kind of like how you saying faith. It's like you believe in it. Yeah. I can give faith, faith, faith more to like the citizens of each island having faith in like a savior. Therefore, Luffy's dry ass, whoever is saving them. But more, I'm talking about like the main story is based on fate. Like it's already written down, like what's supposed to happen. Faith right. is more like a belief in like things gonna get better. Faith is like it's like this is supposed to happen. In yeah. order for us to succeed, Luffy gotta go to dress Rosa. Luffy gotta be saved right here in this particular minute. I gotta send y'all twenty years into the future in order to stop Kaido. That's that's the perfect time. We because how do you know exactly where to send them? When to send them? We literally saw Kinnaman when we supposed to see Kinnaman. See what I'm saying? We saw yeah. like we met Momon we met Momonosuke when we were supposed to meet Momonosuke. That's why I'm more so like she 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 kinda had to know exactly like what to do. Like how to know to send us twenty years, how to know she not gonna be no help. Just leaving your son is crazy. But I think she did that because she knew that the, her time was up. Yeah, she definitely I ain't doing that. Say for instance, say for instance, you know, like what you put on the what what you was put on the world to do was to send them twenty years into the future, right? So you gonna sit in that burning um the burning house and die? Who's to say she even died? Right. She said she would stay here. That didn't mean she was burned up. Who's to say she even died? She you probably know. alive. She probably was like, yeah, y'all go. I I see y'all. That's probably what happened. I can't have her fruit, bro. I don't I don't want to waste my life by only being able to go into the future. Yeah, it'd be in moderation. See, she ain't using it right. No. She ain't using it right. You know what I'm using it? When I'm in the line, or I'm on the phone, waiting for the call collector. Hello? Yes, yes, uh, I wanted to do. You gotta crazy. use it in moderation. She, she wildin', she wildin', you know what I'm saying? Or well, somebody get on my nerves, I'm sending them 50 years in the future so I never see their face again. You can send other people, obviously. That's crazy. I only look at you because you you a karma person. Okay. So obviously they did something to me. I'm not about to just randomly send somebody. I'm gonna be like, man, you you buggers. You know what that deserves? Twenty years. Bop, get out of here. Like, don't bother me. I'm gonna be like, hey, don't leave, leave me alone. I can see you to the future. And you gonna bother me? You gone. But you die of ignorance. Huh? <laughs> How do y'all always bring everything back to that? Because like what you just said, it was so. I'm not killing. Cutthroat. I'm not doing genocide. The person's still alive. No. <laughs> like, what are you talking about? Like you, like you made it seem like yeah, don't bother me. Twenty years, like that's like a that's like a uh, twenty years into the future. Not to, now. I'm not about to kill you. I'm seeing. How you know they probably they time was probably within that twenty years. I will know what they doing because I I got the time time for obviously. It ain't gonna be a good. It ain't gonna be a good future. I, I'm not about to see you so you can get a million dollars. <laughs> Just but get away yeah, from me. I definitely see what you're saying with the fake thing. You know what I'm saying? It's just I want it to be explained so it's easier to like grasp and like kind of like have a certain like take on it when people understand it. It's just um I enjoy that one piece is like, I don't know, man, like time time fruit is one of the fruits that I would never think would be in this show. But now that it's here and it's kind of like making the, the world kind of open up a little more, it's starting to like fit a little bit, if that makes sense. Like with Toki, like if she's talking to the people or like planning stuff in the future and maybe things that we've seen like before that happened, like when I first watched, probably connected back to something like that, then that'll make more sense. I mean, yeah, I kind of figured that was gonna happen, to be honest. Like when we saw it, that was our reaction to it. And when we asked y'all about it, some some reason I knew they were going to. I knew people was going to comment like this. Yeah, it was weird to me, but 
Oda's going to make it better. You know what I'm saying? I, I asked y'all that. Like, asked I her, knew that was going to be a response. I knew that was going to be a response. We asked y'all what y'all think about it at that at moment. At that moment. Not that moment. What's going to try to make it better in the future? I knew. And you know what's crazy? As we were saying that, I knew that they were going to say that. I was like, they probably going to be like, but Oda's going to make it all better. I was like, I already know he's going to say that. Like, I have faith that Oda explaining this more. It's still, to me, it's just time travel in itself was the weird part. Yeah. I'm not, it, it didn't diminish, it didn't diminish Oda's writing style. Somebody said that we picking on writers all the time. We not, it didn't diminish that. It didn't diminish the story. It was just a weird thing to insert into One Piece. That's all it was. When you're watching reactors and you see, they, they give you their opinions on stuff, everybody has their own opinions and just take it and you know, if you agree, you agree. If you don't, you don't. You know what I'm saying? You gotta be. I don't know. This is hard. It's hard. Bro. All y'all don't. All y'all didn't didn't comment that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All y'all don't think like that. So I'm sorry. We're just addressing what we saw. That's all. That, not really addressing. Just bringing it up. To be honest, I ain't really addressing it. Well, it, it don't. It's not stinking enough. Anymore. But it was cool seeing that story. Like I said, it kind of remind me of Nolan. Like this. It's kind of up there with the Odin summer with like the, when we got the Nolan and stuff kind of flashes. Remind me of that. And he kind of did the same thing with Nolan. Like Nolan kind of saved the people and uh, created medicine to help heal them from the, the rotten stuff that they was going through. Mm -hmm. This dude, Odin come in, save Curie. You know what I'm saying? Kind of the same way. I like stories like this. Any cool with Whitebeard and um, Goldie Roger. Yeah. I want to know more about that. Yeah. I want, I want to know, know how he actually died. I know yeah, he got it. Horrific yeah. death. Hmm? Horrific death. You saw people like stabbing at him and stuff. Yeah. So. But yeah, man. Uh, just got to keep watching. Dope episode. <clears throat> Hope y'all enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Make sure I check these videos out on our Patreon before we put them on YouTube. Thanks. Thanks for checking out. Peace. Peace.